All right. All right, let's let's get this going then. Um where do we begin? Where do we begin? So, the 2023 Philadelphia Phillies. Now, I'll admit, I haven't been paying attention much since the start of the season. A certain hockey team had me occupied until the literally the first couple days of May. And I've, of course, made videos about them. But, the Phillies, my baseball team that I root for. And I got this beautiful throwback baby blue uh, jersey. This is a legit one uh, from the uh, 80s, I guess is when they wore these, the, the throwbacks. This isn't the uh, the new ones that they wear for every Thursday home game. But uh, I was uh, happy to find this in a uh, old collection in my, uh, my grandfather's uh, closet. When I was last in Pennsylvania. So I appreciate this. And uh, I will probably be wearing it now. But anyways. The Phillies. Oh the Phillies. The Phillies. The Phillies. Oh boy. Where do I begin? Well. I'll start with this. It's the second week of May. Or third week of May. It's still early in the year, but if things don't change and quickly, you're going to get yourself in a hole that you can't come out of. I'm just going to say that. You can't be down going into July, August, Hell, June 1st is really it, man. You, you got to show you're going to be a playoff team by June 1st if you really want to have a chance. And I know, oh, last year they were under 500 when Girardi got fired. Rob Thompson came in, took him on the streak, on and on and so forth. I get that. But do you really expect that to happen again? They're not going to fire the manager this year. The dude just signed. He took you to a World Series. You're not going to fire him. He's not the problem. No, 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 no. Rob, Rob Thompson is not the problem here. The main problem, once again, like every fucking year I've been saying it, pitching. Of course. Pitching, pitching, pitching is this team's demise and downfall. They suck. They're trash. I don't want to hear the excuses. Who's your best pitcher right now? Fucking. Based off ERA, let me see this. Fucking Wheeler? Eh? ERA, sure, but everything else, he has the most strikeouts. But even though he, he's 3-3 three and three so far in the year, he ain't doing good. I just... I don't know how many times I need to say it. It's a broken record at this point. They need a revamping of this entire pitching staff and I get that Andrew Painter is injured and he's not going to be back until fucking August I've been reading good lord but one guy ain't going to save us he's not if Wheeler and Nola are underperforming the supposed two best pitchers on this staff <clears throat> great you ain't going anywhere. Because I said it last year. You can't go all in with one and leave the other hanging. And this season even about the batting staff. And honestly, they're, they're, they're near top 10 in team stats and everything in the league. The pitching staff, 20th of low already in anything. <sighs> I 
You ain't winning the NL East. I'm telling you that right now. Braves are really the only legit team. Even then, they have their flaws. They ain't this whole division really is mid. I gotta be honest with you. Looking at it right now, Braves 28 and 16. Miami second place, 23 and 21. Mets tied with Miami for second. Miami has the tiebreaker. Mets are 23 and 23. Philadelphia 20 and 24. Nationals, they're trash, 18 25. I don't know, man. I I I look at this. A negative 29 run differential. Braves are plus 61. Next closest is the Mets with minus 19, but. <sighs> now, again, am I judging too early? Yeah, I'll admit that. It's May, but you're performing right now, and you're just going down and down and down. You're losing the teams you shouldn't be losing to. Getting swept by the Giants? I get we don't perform against them, but swept? Ugh. And you lose 10-1 last night to the Cubs. The Cubs. 10-1 fucking one to the Cubs. Good lord, y'all stop. Stink! Ugh! I don't know. What? I don't have the answers for what needs to change. I don't. I don't know. These batting stats, too, man, are just pissing me off as well. Um... Nick Castellanos has the best uh, av batting average right now with a 304. JT is right behind him with also 304. Bryson Stott, uh, 280. Brandon Marsh, 281. Alec Bohm, 272. Decent. Trey Turner. Oh, boy, Trey Turner. Oh, boy. Boy, oh, boy, Trey Turner. Look, man, you get touted as the best shortstop in baseball. Oh, he's such a good fit. Oh, he'll do this. He'll do that. Oh, those. Remember the World Baseball Classic? Oh. Look what he's doing in the World Baseball Classic. Oh. Oh, leading Team USA to the finals. 262 batting average, four home runs, 43 games played, 48 hits, 24 runs, 10 RBIs, slugging a .399, OPS .707, and an OPB of 308. Man. He got booed last night. I don't blame him. I mean, Philly sports fans are Philly sports fans. There's no really need to explain that, but... Oh, God. I'm just... I... I don't know. You keep going down this path, you're not going to recover. You're not... It's going to get too late in the season, and you're going to dig yourself too much of a hole that you can't climb out of. And I know I said it last year. I said this team was trash. I said they weren't a playoff team. They made it to the World Series. Because they got hot at the right time. So, I think. I'm going to say it. Last year's World Series one. Fraudulent. It was a vehicle. They just got hot at the right time. And that's what you really need in a team. If you get hot at the right time, you'll go in places. But you run into a jug saw that is uh, the uh, Houston Astros. And 
Ooh, I've been over those stats, man. You can't play this game of bats, 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 and pitching continues to suck, suck, suck. But there's a problem. You don't have any other options. That's the problem. So we're stuck. We're stuck. You got two more games against the Cubs, boys. Try and win one. One at this point would be nice. Then you got the D-backs, Braves, Mets, Nationals going into June. Like I said, June 1st is fast approaching. Wake up. I'm not saying it's over yet, as much as I would like to. But your season is starting to get on life support. We'll see what happens in June, but right now it's not looking good. You are fourth place looking in right now for a wild card spot. Mets ahead of you, Giants ahead of you, Cubs ahead of you. You're, you're ahead of the Padres right now, but... I mean, this team went to the World Series last year. Fuck. They tricked me. They fucking tricked me. I don't know. I don't know. Will they turn it around? Who the hell knows? But so far... They ain't showing me a reason why I should watch the game. And I think I'm going to tune out for a little bit. Got to prove yourself that I care, boys. And maybe then you'll get my viewership. Oh, I'll keep track of games. Oh, I will. I'll, I'll, uh, I'll get the notifications on my phone, see how you're doing. But you ain't going to see me watch a Phillies game anytime soon. <laughs> no way, Jose. Uh-uh. I ain't wasting my time watching that trash. <laughs> God, man. It's just the same thing. Over and over. Over again. And I even bet on the Phillies last night. Hey, I thought, hey, you know, the Cubs aren't really that good. You're coming off a tough road trip out rest. Maybe coming home would energize the guys. 43,000 plus at Citizens Bank Ballpark last night. Nope. What do they do? Spit in our faces. Screw you. Screw you. But, hey, maybe they turn around in the month of June. Maybe. We'll see. Excuse me. We'll see. But, I don't trust them for a damn. Unless this pitching staff magically turns it around. Trey Turner starts becoming Trey Turner. <laughs> 11 years, 300 plus million. Good lord. Oh, Jesus, God. This team's got to turn it around. Plain and simple. If not, uh, yeah, you are not making playoffs this year. And, oh, boy, there may be some firings after this season. And maybe then that'll wake this front office up. But what the hell do I know? I'm just a dude in Jersey who roots for a team in Philly. One team in Philly, that's it. And it's it's these guys. I could give less of a shit, of course, about the Flyers. Eagles. I mean, I wanted them to win the Super Bowl, but eh. 76ers, God, no. <laughs> I'm a Phillies fan, that's it. And this team is giving me no reason to watch right now 
or really care about him. So, I guess we'll see what happens. So, all right, I think I got it all out of my system. So, with that, I guess that'll do it for this one. Thank you all for watching, of course. My name is Trevor, and I will see you in the next one.